His family may have simply forgotten about him when they went inside for a service. The temperature was about 100 degrees. Chris Van Cleve is in New York with how one car maker's new technology could help reduce the risk. Chris, good morning. Good morning. The inside of a car can jump 20 degrees in just 10 minutes, and we know it's going to be almost 100 degrees in much of the country today. That's particularly dangerous for small children because their body temperatures can heat up four times as fast as adults, and if it reaches 107, that can be fatal. Eight-month-old Rayleigh Mercer died last month after being left in a hot car for two hours. Her father apparently forgot to drop her at daycare, parked his car, and went to work. It reached 93 degrees that day in Louisiana. I know he's destroyed over this because he loves his girls, he loves his kids, and he loves his wife. And this is just a horrible accident. So far this year, 23 kids in 14 states have died after being left in hot cars. Experts say heat stroke can happen when the outside temperature is as low as 57 degrees. She was the youngest of three, uh, blonde hair and beautiful blue eyes. Um, just a great, great child, always happy. Reggie McKinnon's 17-month-old daughter Peyton died after he forgot to drop her off at daycare following a doctor's appointment. He drove back to work just one block from Peyton's daycare. When I opened the, the back door to the vehicle, um, you know, that's the moment that my, my life and my family's life changed forever. I found Peyton uh, still in her car seat. It's such a tragic death. It's very preventable. Deborah Hurstman is the former chair of the NTSB and now runs the National Safety Council. She's urging parents to look before they lock their cars. Truly, it's that we are distracted by the task at hand. We're not remembering the most precious cargo that's in the back seat. That's a warning sound General Motors hopes can help prevent these types of accidents. The new technology built into the 2017 GMC Acadia is the first of its kind to alert drivers if a rear door was opened prior to the start of their current drive. A simple reminder that could save a life. There are some smartphone apps that can remind parents, but they have to remember to use them. This warning system, the beeping you can hear here, will be expanded to other GM models in the near future. Gail? All right, Chris. Don't you think whatever technology oh, they can do to speed that up, I can't think of anything worse for a parent. Absolutely That's terrible. Care. Thank, you. No. Thank you, Chris. Clinton's worlds collide. Coming up next, how the 42nd president will pass the nomination baton to his wife to make political history.